everybody welcome back to my channel it's been a few days since i've come and um, channeled a message but i have one that i was really pushed to channel i didn't know whether or not i wanted to channel this message because of the energy um this energy is a energy of sadness and maybe entrapment or forcibility I cleanse my space of all negative energy. I cleanse my space of all negative energy and I welcome my ancestors. Okay. All right, what this energy is to me is the energy of maybe women that are being held and not necessarily held, but they're in a situation where they have what you would call a madam, okay? And for those who don't know what a madam is, a madam is a woman who basically takes dominion over these girls and have them doing and performing sexual acts for money, okay? For the purpose of herself, really, and, and whoever she's with. Okay, I have a card here, wow. I have a card here that's backwards, okay? This card that's in my deck is backwards and it's messages and dreams, okay? And that's funny because a little bit of this information did come to me from a dream, okay? They basically telling me to tell the truth and be honest, okay? So I did have a dream. Thank you, ancestors. <laughs> However, um, my dream needs clarity, which is the reason why I came to the cards. Um, I do apologize if my energy seems to be a little bit depleted. Um, I have been receiving downloads for the past maybe a week. Um, but yeah, that's the energy that I'm getting. These girls are not necessarily held against their will. They are allowed to leave, but I think the leaving comes with stipulations. I'm not quite sure. Um, but I do ask the ancestor to help me channel this message. I ask the ancestors that you um, tune into my frequency or allow me to tune into yours with the power of three. Okay, so the first card out that we have is messages and dreams, okay? This message was sort of kind of, it was choppy in a dream. So I woke up to see exactly what I'm, what do I do with it? Um, did not want to channel this message. However, I do what I'm told, okay? If I'm chosen, I do what I'm told, okay? Because this message I, I just got can transform somebody's life, okay? Transformation. We are in the time where Pluto is in Aquarius, Okay, so these are the times for transformation. This message is meant to transform somebody's life. Okay, this is a group of girls. Okay, ancestors, please speak through the cards. They're saying divine timing. Trust divine timing. Okay, let me get a few of these cards out just so I can see what message is about to be told here. Okay, we got detachment and code detachment and cold all right this one is hanging out we got confusions and illusions okay confusions and illusions and i'm gonna take one more oh that was two i don't want to take those i need one more specifically i need this to that's two okay Hold on. I need this message to be specific. I, I don't want to pick from no cards. I need this message to be specific, ancestors. Let me give me one more specific. I don't want to have to shuffle through no cards and pick. No, I don't want to do that. I need you to give me specific cards, okay? One card at a time. Thank you. Epiphany and breakthrough. 
okay? All right, and at the bottom we have control, wow, and tactics, okay? So this is telling me that the energy that I was feeling is correct, okay? This is the energy that I was feeling. This is somewhat the energy that my dream was, okay? And I, I am not going to share my dream in no way, shape, or form, okay? Um, this is telling me that it is time for whoever these women are to detach from the confused state that they're in, the illusion that they've been put up under, okay? Now is the time to have this breakthrough, okay? To release the control. Do you see the heel on the man's face? Remember I said a madam, okay? It is time to release yourself from this situation, okay? This situation is really hot, okay? This situation is hot. This situation involves sex, it involves money, and it involves men. Okay? All right. I need to keep that control one at the top because that was one of the main cards. The ancestors are here because that's the top. That's the card now. Thank you, ancestors. All right. So as I said... This is a message for those women. It, it's at least four and as many as eight, okay? These women are in a house with the older woman, okay? They are under a control, okay? They're not being held against their will, but they feel as if they cannot move forward, okay? They feel like that is their only option, okay? And it's not. You have options out here. The cards are saying it is divine timing. And you have the ancestors here. Okay. Ancestors. Closest to the sun. All right. We got the king of wands. Okay. So it's showing me that there is a man involved here too. It's not just a woman. Okay. There is a man involved in basically sex trafficking these girls, okay? And making them feel as if they need to do this in order to make a way for themselves, okay? We have the Ace of Pentacles, okay? You girls need to under, this is a God card, is an Ace. You girls need to understand that God is the only one that can offer you that stable um, home, that stable life, um, and, and just sub stability, period, harmony, okay stability harmony and flow it does not come from man or this woman who seems to have control over you guys right now okay i hope this message gets to whoever it needs to get to because this is a very specific group of people okay these group of women are, as I said, is being controlled. But now is your time to be detached. You need to detach. Speak through the cards, ancestors. It's time for you to come out. Okay, come outside. Okay, these women feel as if they are closed in. They feel as if they're trapped. When they are able to leave, you know, they're being held in a way that they're held down mentally. Okay, they're being told that you can't do it without me. You can't do this without me. You can't do that without me. You need me. When in actuality, it's the other way around. This madam and this gentleman need them. Okay, you women basically need to free yourself. Because right now they have your world upside down. They're making you believe that you can do nothing. I don't read cards upside down. Okay, they making you believe that you do not hold the power in your hands. You do. Okay, each and every last one of these women have a particular type of strength. Okay, and some of these women may have tapped into that strength that they, they do possess. Okay, we see in divine timing here on the board. God, the ancestors, they are present. Somebody is having some sort of breakthrough. Somebody is ready to break free from the confusions, okay? You do have the power to remove yourself from darkness with the moon. 
okay? You do have the power to remove yourself from darkness. Okay, see through the cards, ancestors. Okay, I'm, I'm getting that somebody needed this message, this particular message, okay? Somebody also have been getting messages in their dreams, okay? Somebody has definitely been getting messages in their dreams, but they're... Um, at a point right now where they can't really understand what these dreams are because of the confusion that they have with the situation, okay? At least one of these girls are pregnant. At least one of these girls are pregnant, okay? These are young girls. They're young. I'm getting 17 to 25. These girl are, girls are young. Okay. If anybody knows of any, and they're, yes, they're definitely being controlled. They're being controlled. Okay. There is some, I, I am feeling some fear here. The girls, like I said, they not necessarily held against their will, but they are scared to leave. They're afraid to leave, okay? Because somebody is taking total control and they're using scare tactics to keep them in place. Sort of like how slavery went for us, for the ancestors, okay? They use tactics to keep these girls scared and in position, okay? With the power of three, speak through the cards, ancestors. Speak through the cards. Somebody sees this. Okay, somebody sees this and somebody is getting blackmailed or somebody is getting threatened for the information that they know. Okay, somebody is getting blackmailed or threatened for the information that they know. Okay, this is not a secret. This is a group of girls that live in a brick house. Okay, they live in a brick house and it's people, if not one person, it's people that is seeing this, but they're afraid to say something. Okay, my advice if that was any of your daughters, your nieces, cousins, grandchildren, would you allow your grandchildren or your daughter, your niece, anybody to stay in a situation like that without saying anything? Okay, these girls need help. These girls are in the dark. I don't know who these girls are. I'm just channeling a message, okay? But these girls need help. A breakthrough okay somebody one at least one of these one or two of these girls have already tried to concoct a plan okay that's that's the energy that i'm getting one or two of these girls are, are two of them they're trying to put together a plan okay what i'm what i'm channeling right now is very very particular I don't know who this information belongs to. I don't know who these girls are, but at least two of them are trying to concoct a plan. Wow. I'm getting that. Two or three of these girls have been there since they were little. So I don't know if they were kidnapped. I don't know if they were adopted. I have no idea, but they have been there since they were little girls, okay? Wow. This is a draining, it's a, a dry, sad information, judgment. God is about to call judgment on the situation. This situation is not going to be a situation for too much longer, okay? The ancestors are, are privy to what's going on. Um, and it is divine timing. So this judgment card, it looks like these girls are going to get a release, okay? And I put the, the release and surrender card, okay? Some people are going to be going to jail, okay? Um, 
I'm getting for the accusations that the girls are going to come forward with. So they are going to get justice. God is saying this is true. Okay. This woman here, the Empress, she is also going to get some time. Okay. Because she's interfered with the happiness of these girls. Okay. God is saying that is true. This is a phoenix coming from the fire. These girls are about to be rebirthed. Okay? But this woman who has interfered with somebody's happiness, that this is the madam. Okay? She is about to get some time. I don't know if that's judgment in this uh, time or judgment like in 3D or is it judgment in the 5D? I have no idea, but... God is definitely about to put an end to this situation. Okay. Wow. Yes. You see, he, I don't read upside down, but it came upside down. You see, he's trying to cover something up. Okay. This is about to be uncovered. This information is about to be revealed. Okay. There's about to be a breakthrough for this group of girls. Okay? I'm getting before I'm getting an actual visual. Before these girls actually came there, this madam did not look like this. She was not like this. This madam couldn't even wash her clothes whenever she needed to wash. This madam didn't have money. This madam didn't um, she was barely eaten before she took these girls in. Okay, once she took these girls in and conditioned them and controlled them is when she became this empress here. Okay, and that's when she began to step on the happiness of these girls. She started to make them feel less than. Okay, one particular girl I'm getting is her actual money maker. This particular girl is the one that they really have the stronghold over. Okay. I'm getting that this one is hot and attractive. Okay. Most popular with the men. Okay. And the other girls are jealous of, of that particular one. The other girls hate on that particular one, okay? And are very mean and nasty and aggressive with her. Okay, so we have two that's trying to concoct a grand escape. We have one who's being basically bullied for her looks and things of that nature. And we have at least two or three that's jealous. Okay, so these girls are, I don't know, they're, 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 they're all hurting for sure. You got at least three that's seeking attention. You have two that's trying to escape and you have one that's just in pure hell, pure hell, okay? The hangman. We got this hangman and basically in reverse. This is about to become unhinged. Okay? It is about to be a complete breakdown of this system, of this organization. Whatever this is where these girls are kept and held um, for, for sexual and um, monetary purposes, it's about to be a, a, a total... It's going to be mayhem for the situation. It's about to, the top is about to blow off of it. It's, people are going to leave here standing on their feet, okay? They're going to be detaching from this situation. Okay, wow. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the Hierophant. And we have the Seven of Cups, okay? This is given married couple, okay? 
this woman, this madam, she's doing this for him. He's in charge, but nobody knows or sees that he's in charge. Okay? And he has at least, if they, like I said, there is at least seven girls in this situation that's being controlled by this couple here. Okay? Even she is being controlled by this hierophant here. However, she is not a prisoner. She comes and goes as she pleases. She controls the money. She, she is not a prisoner. She is a willing participant in this situation. Okay? Thank you, ancestors. There is another one that actually controls the girls, okay? Drives them bonkers, okay? Drives them bonkers. This girl here, so we have the high, we have the um, the higher font with the with the married couple. We got that married couple here, but then we have somebody who is actually in control of keeping the girls in order, okay? She drives them cuckoo. All right, she drives them bonkers and she is really the reason why they feel trapped. Okay, so we have three that's at least in charge. We got the married couple and then we have her here. Okay, I don't know if this girl here is actually a, um, a victim. Have no idea, but this girl maintain some sort of power over the other girls and she's the one that keeps them in order or in check she sends them crazy okay she makes them feel trapped okay this one here wow it's all for money this is all for money okay there is no balance no balance in this home at all. There is no balance. We have three women who's con contemplated suicide. These three women that they're in despair. Okay. I'm getting that two of them are the ones that's trying to concoct a plan. They are in despair. Okay. They feel hopeless because they are stuck and in solitude and they feel as if no one knows about what's going on. But as I showed you earlier, Someone sees this, okay? It is people that actually sees this, okay? This stay at the bottom. This is showing me that these girls are, are slowly, uh, they're slowly getting themselves together for the big breakthrough. We got one peeking out at the top. What is this? Yes, a tower. These girls are, are slowly getting themselves together. Things are going to open up for these girls. If any of these girls is watching this, you are about to have a big breakthrough okay you are about to have a tower moment where god lifts you up out of this situation okay it is divine timing i don't know how long these girls have been there but it is divine timing okay somebody has been working towards hmm somebody has been working towards keeping this a secret Okay, they've been working and trying to balance out protecting the secret, okay? Protecting these three people, the man and the two women that's in control. Somebody is working, trying to help them be undetected, okay? So I don't know if this is somebody in law enforcement I don't know what this is, but somebody is working towards keeping balance 
okay with these with the with the three that's that totally has control over these girls okay they're working hard at it they're trying to block things from being revealed but like i said it is about to be a tower okay these girls are going to be vindicated okay they're going to rise out of this okay speak through the cards ancestors speak through the cards yeah it's a bunch of sadness sadness here Okay, I'm getting at least two of these girls are sick. Two of these girls are sick. Okay, this sickness comes from the situation. Two of these girls are sick, okay? They have been sick because of sexual practices. They have been infected by lovers. Okay, they are infected because of this situation. All right, I don't know exactly what disease this is. I don't know if this is mental. I have no idea, but two of these girls are sick because of their situation. Okay, I'm getting STD here. Okay, I'm getting STD. through the cars ancestors I have a queen of basically pentacles a queen of pentacles what is this ancestors okay there is going to be a woman there is a woman who is a star seed who is going to basically bring light to this situation. Okay? There is going to be a woman who brings light to this situation. Okay? We got the heart here. This woman okay this woman was a victim herself okay at some point this woman was a victim herself but she transformed okay she was a victim herself but she transformed and became this queen of pentacles okay now she's seeking justice for those girls she wants justice for her situation and she wants justice for um the rest of the girls that's here. Okay. No. Okay, that's it with these cards here. Oh, wow. Anybody who knows anything about a situation where any girls are being held either against their will or held, hit will or held um mentally and is afraid to leave because of the mental anguish that somebody has caused them um i ask that th these people speak out okay this is the time of helping others this is the year seven okay this is the year that god is using people to help others okay to be that guiding light to help others out of a terrible situation that they could possibly be in okay the bottom of this deck says perfect setting okay this is the perfect setting the year of seven as i just said to help people okay don't block your own blessings because you're seeing something going on and you're not you're not speaking about it 
you detached and you cold because it ain't you or because it ain't nobody that you know. It is your duty, one, two, three. It is your duty to help others, especially in this year of seven, okay? It is your duty to bring people to the light. This is the year where people are getting dreams and downloads on what their, what their spiritual journey is, okay? That's what has actually happened with some of these girls here, okay? At least two of them has had an awakening, okay? This is the reason for their trying to create a grand escape here. Ancestors, give me some messages. Give me some messages, ancestors. Speak through the cards. Okay. It says, trust your own understanding and potential gateway. Okay? Trust your own understanding. If you know that you're seeing something and this is not right, it is your job to help these girls, okay? You could be the potential gateway, all right? People have intuition. You know when something is not right. You know when something is strange. You know when a house is operating and you're like, what's going on over there? And, you know, I see these girls, but, you know, you know when something is not right. You have to be the gateway for them, okay? It could be your words that free these girls from this terrible situation, okay? So you can be a potential gateway for these girls. It says to pause, okay? If you're confused about what it is that you should be doing, take a moment and think. Your inner self, your higher self will tell you what to do. Your inner self and your higher self will even tell you, you will know right off when you see it, that something is not right. You take that moment and when you feel that, you pause and you'll get the rest of the information, okay? Catch your breath and intuition. That's basically what I just said. Take a moment. Think about it. Catch your breath. Okay? And listen to your intuition. Your intuition will tell you. This is the year of breakthrough. This is the year where people start to speak out in what they believe, you know? This is the year of gratitude and appreciation, okay? This particular year here is the year that God is going to really recognize, okay? So did you see this situation and you just kept it moving because it ain't got nothing to do with you? Did you see this situation and you happy already so you don't care? Was you in this situation and you out and you know about it, but you don't care? This is the year that we help one another, okay? This is the year that we detach from this cold world. And you know it's been cold. You know it's been cold. The food has been poisoned. The water has been tainted. Detach from this cold world. Be something different. Jump outside of the fishbowl, okay? Those people that stuck inside of this fishbowl, those are the people that wait to get fed, okay? This is the year that you go out and you go get it yourself, okay? Quit letting people just give you the information, the bare minimum of the information, and you think that it's good to go when it's not, okay? You have somebody here who is saying, oh, that's my cousin, and they, they in from downtown, and... You, this is the type of situation that we got going here. Because this person is trying to explain why all of these girls are in their house. They're my cousins. Like I take in Foster. Or is they're trying to explain the reason for these girls. But it's somebody out here, multiple people, that sees what's going on. And they're not attempting to 
question it past the explanation that they got. Okay? We need to wake up. We need to wake up and detach and help some people out here. These girls are not the only ones that need help. You have men that need help as well. You have boys that need help as well. You have kids that need help as well. This is basically the way of the world for a better word agenda. Okay? Um, we need to do better for our people, you guys. We really do. Speak through the cards, ancestors. These girls are in despair, though. They are in despair. They, they confused. They don't know what to do. They don't know how to feel. But as I said, there is a man that's in charge of this whole thing. He is the leader. Okay? Remember, there was a man that came out first. This was the very first card out. Okay? So it's a man that's in charge of this whole thing. But it's a married couple here. This man has been doing this for a long time. Okay? And, so, and like I said, it, I believe some of these girls were children. They were children. Some of them were children when they first came. Okay? So these girls have been held. Some of these girls have been in this situation for a long time. Speak through the cards, ancestors. It is about to be recognized now. Okay, this is a situation that is going to be blown wide open. This is going to be basically a break in the case. This comfort that this man has possessed for all of these years with this woman, it's about to be recognized. Okay, God is about to shine light on that situation. Yes, God is about to shine light on those lovers. Okay, and the manipulation and everything that they've been putting these girls through. Okay, these this couple here has been living in luxury off of these girls. They have been living in luxury. Okay, it's about to come to an end. These girls are about to have a big victory. They are about to be free from this situation. Okay. Okay. These girls are about to have balance. Okay. They're about to have balance. Not only that, they are about to come across a lot of compassion and understanding. They are about to move into a life of healing and where they're going to find their prince charming. Okay. And have a new beginning. Okay. These girls are about to come out of this situation and it's not going to take them too long to heal because being free from that situation is healing in itself. Okay? They're going to embark on a love, at least two of these people. These are the two that um, that were trying to escape. These are the two that has had a dream or two. Okay? They are about to find somebody who is compassionate and understanding. Okay? And they are about to have a new beginning. Okay. okay, these girls are highly capable. These girls are queens. Okay, and they are highly capable. Okay. Ancestors, what is the outcome for this couple? What is the outcome for this couple? Power of three. What is the outcome of this couple? Looks like they're going to be running. They are going to be running. Okay. They're going to evade the police, but they will be captured. Okay. They will be captured. Yeah. 
the lovers did this for money, okay? And they were in the dark. This was a secret. This has been happening for quite some time. The, 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 the real purpose for this was for money, greed. Okay, and this has been in the dark. These people are probably lovable couples in the daytime. But in their home, they're dark. Okay, they are not of God at all. What is the outcome of these girls? They will have balance. Okay. They are of the sun. Okay. And they will become a high priestess. This is the outcome of these girls. Balance. Star seeds. Okay. This is the outcome for the girls. Meanwhile, the couple is going to be on a run, but they will be captured. All right, last pull. From a different realm, I need advice. From a different realm, ancestors, from a different realm. I need three cards from a different realm with the power of three. Three cards. Give me three cards, ancestors. Speak through the cards. One. Two. Okay, I'm going to take the three like I said. Upside down. Okay, that's upside down. I'll, I'll use it, but let me explain these first. We have the Lady of Lightning. Surprises, sometimes shock, and total paradigm shift. Okay? There is about to be light shined on this whole situation. It's going to shock the shit out of this couple. Okay? I'm sorry. I try not to cuss on here. But this couple is about to get the shit shocked out of them. Okay? All right? Because of the acts that they've been doing for quite some time now. Okay. The diamond dreamer, material wealth, true prosperity. Okay. These people did this because of material wealth. Okay. But this was not true prosperity. Okay. They didn't gain riches and wealth through divine timing. Okay. They gained riches and wealth through uh, the entrapment and confusion of women, girls, okay? And therefore they're going to get the shit shocked out of them, okay? The swine queen, there's going to be a transformation here with these girls, okay? Their intuition is going to come through shining like a light beam, okay? I'm asking these girls, whoever they are to be patient Okay, because things are about to come to a close, okay? It's going to be a complete paradigm shift. A paradigm shift is things was working like this, now it don't. For example, okay, the water system in America works a certain type of way. It goes through a system where it's cleaned, this, that, and the other, put through pipes and put in everybody's home. Paradigm shift of that is, okay, all of that is completely shut down and we rely on the rain for water. Paradigm shift. Okay, nothing is going to be how it was. So I'm asking these ladies to please be patient and I'm asking those who see the situation happening, please speak up. Okay, half of the deck here. Yes. These people are putting on a facade. Who you think they are, they are not. Okay? But the sun is about to be shined on this situation. 
and I'm getting by the winter. By the winter, light will be shined on the situation and that is going to cause conflict and disharmony. Okay? So you heard it here with um, Truly Divinely Sent. Thank you for joining my channel. I do apologize for um, not putting out uh, a channel message in about a week, but I've been trying to take in upgrades and downloads, okay? So please forgive me for that. I do ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if this touched anybody, if you know of anybody that's in a situation, please help these people. They could be girls, they could be boys, they could be children. If you know of anybody that is in a situation wait, that, where they are held against their will, not held against their will, but entrapped, or feel like they're scared to, to come out of this situation, it is our duty, especially as light workers, to help these people, okay? Because it's going to be a big shock anyway. This is going to be a paradigm shift for this couple. I really do feel bad for this couple, okay? Um, but thank you for joining my channel, and I'll catch you on the next one.